Hi guys, so I thought I would start this uh, vlog with going to the salon. I am I'm heading to beauty space. I've washed my hair at home. I've had my hair open for the past two weeks. I'm a skiacamba accent on that sentence. <laughs> anyway, so I'm trying to fight um, a cold. I feel like I'm getting a cold. Um, my throat is not okay. It's a bit congested. So I'm trying to fight it before it becomes worse. Because why? It becomes worse. I am just on bed rest, honestly. So I'm heading to beauty space, and I'll show you guys the products that I used somewhere here. I'll attach um, a video of the products that I used to um, wash my hair. So I'm torn between um, box, uh, what are they called? Knotless braids, and um, are they called sister locks or something? Um, the really light ones. Um, I only have those two options. I can't do lines. Lines won't last me. Um, I need something that will last me like four weeks. So lines won't do it. So I'm torn between the two. Because I won't be able to go to the salon again in a while. Yeah, so we are starting this self-care vlog. With going to the salon and then um, I'm meeting my sister there. So I'll show you guys how um, the hair looks like afterwards. I'm also struggling to drive, like the, the steering is literally on my tummy. So I can't make like turns, like swift turns the way I used to. I have to be more careful um, with the turns and the steering because my tummy is really... <laughs> But I thought since the salon is not that far away from home, today I can drive myself. Plus I have a full tank of fuel. So it didn't make sense to Uber. And I have a full tank of fuel. I don't know if that makes sense. I really wanted to Uber, but when? I just refilled my tank. That would be a waste of money. Why Uber and I have a full tank? I need to clear this full tank. Um... I may not be going anywhere in the next few months so let me just use it instead of spending extra money on Uber. I'll just go pole pole come back pole pole yeah, it should be okay so by now guys oh, I got um, not less braids done I've just remembered I didn't mention that when I left the salon so I had not less braids done on my hair on my head <laughs> Um, and this is like I don't know how many days later so we're starting on the self-care um, the reason I'm doing this is because someone mentioned that I won't be able to shower um, in the hospital <laughs> so I thought let me just do like a self-care day I do all my shaving I do all my scrubbing body scrubbing and everything because I may not be able to shower well when i'm in hospital so i thought let me do this um so that's why we are doing the self-care video now i thought it's necessary plus i don't think i'll get time to do um like a proper self-care when the baby comes so yeah so first things first i'm lighting up this candle i got as a gift from nh um homes so she gifted me two um fragrances so this one is a black berry and bay and they're made of um dried roses and crystal stones and they smell amazing and this is how they look so i have one already lighting up in the shower area in the bathroom and then this one um i want to light it up here before we start so this one is the black uh berry and bay the one in the bathroom is i think coconut something i'll go i'll confirm when i show you guys so this is how they look inside so pretty such a beautiful candle if you ask me and the scent is amazing guys really really nice even without burning you can already um Oh, this smells so nice. So yeah, 
I want to put this up, up here so that it can be burning. So by now you guys already know the process of my self-care routine. I usually start with the eyebrows, um, oil the hair and mask. Then we go to the bathroom, we do lip care and then take a shower. So I won't be doing much of voiceover, so I'll just sometimes I'll write down something and um, the other times I'll just explain to you the products before we start. So, <coughs> oh, and these are my new nails. I had them done at Lux. Uh, we went with the lilac this time and I'll show you my feet. And um, I'm thinking of going back um, either I think I'll go back like Saturday morning and have the nails removed and treated because um, I won't be able to go back. In case they grow, I won't be able to remove the polish at home myself. So I'll have to go for a nail treatment session at Lux. So I think I'll do that either on Instagram and I'll show you guys how the nail treatment goes. So first things first, let me do my eyebrows. Let me clean up and then um, put on hair oil and then mask For my hair, I'm using um, the TCB Sheen Spray. It has olive oil, argan oil, and coconut oil. So this is the hair spray that I'm going to use. And for hair oil, I'm going to use um, the TCB Restoring Argan Oil. Um, this is how it looks. Normally, I usually um, do the Oz Argan Oil, but today I'm trying out something different and doing TCB. So today I'm not using my matcha mud mask. I decided to use the Garnier Hydro Bomb um, tissue mask. So this is what I'm using today just to change things a bit. And I got it from um, Jumia. So I will link it down below for you guys. Unfortunately, we don't have a code uh, for the month of December. But... Um, I have some awesome links at the description box down below so you can check them out for any Jumia product that I will use and please please use the link to make your orders because um, that's how you're getting paid um, this month <laughs> things are a bit different so if you see me sharing any links kindly use the links to make your orders uh, for Jumia um, but there won't be any um discount code it's cold so you can also follow me on instagram um that's where i'll, I'll probably be linking most products um things that are on offer or discounted and you can use those links to shop Azure, despite not having codes, Junior will, will still have some amazing discounts for you guys, uh, so you can still check them out. So I'm just going to let this sit for 15 minutes, then we head over to shower. So this is a um, candle from NH. 
that I have in burning in the bathroom. So this one is this is coconut lime. And it smells really amazing as you can see it's also made of dried rose roses and uh, crystal stones oh this place smells amazing the bathroom really really smells amazing right now the baby is kicking so you can um squeeze out the baby is kicking. You can squeeze out um, the, the residue left behind, put it in a bottle and you can use it to be massaging on your face um, if you wish but I don't have the energy and time to do that but I highly recommend doing that to get the maximum out of your Garnier um, tissue masks. Okay, so I've, I'm going to wet my face a little bit, then I'm going to use the La Roche-Posay Purifying Foam um, Cleanser together with this face scrub I got from Feminine Hub. I will link it below. I will link it down below. It comes with four attachments. There's a long brush, I think a short brush, a massager and a silicone brush. So I, I shared that in like, um, I think my Christmas video has um, the unboxing of this one. So it comes with its own stand. So I will link it again in the description box in case you're interested and it's electrical. Um, it's not, um, you don't use battery on it. So I'm just going to wet my face then wash my face with the La Roche-Posay cleanser. So when you get into the shower, I'm just going to wash like behind my ears and the neck area and I want to wash my face again. got a new toothbrush from um, the feminine hub also it's also an electric it's an electric toothbrush and it has um, five cent settings clean polish white gum care and sensitive um, so I'll also link this down below I link her page basically just see the many stuffs she has I'm using um, the tank scraper or tank cleaner. So this one I got it from Portal Pharmacy. I'll also link it down below.
really love the scent of this candle. I've even brought it near the people talking outside. I've even brought it near just to get a perfect um, scent of it. So, um, the first thing I'm doing is oiling my face and I'm using a remis. This is what I've been using of late and I may have to shift to Vaseline once the baby comes I'll shift to Vaseline for my entire body we'll talk about that when I'm packing my hospital bag so I'm just doing a remis on my face uh, for my body I'm using Cetaphil and um, the palmas dry and itchy skin. I've talked about my skin being very itchy throughout this pregnancy. And these two products have been my holy grail. So this is the Cetaphil for eczema, soothing, moisturizing. It also soothes itchy and irritating skin. So these two have been my holy grail uh, for oiling my body. The entire pregnancy, as you can see, I'm almost over with this one. Even this one, I can't even pump anymore. I'll have to remove this to get the last of the lotion inside because it's almost over um, and I got them both at Portal Pharmacy also so I will link um, them down below for you guys um, like I said I can't use this uh, pumping thing I have to like get the last of it like this <laughs> um, so I usually go with Cetaphil first then um, the oil and it soothes my skin for the entire day. So basically anything I do for like my upper body, it's the same thing I'll do for my legs, just that I won't show because um, it means changing the angle of it, just that I won't show it in this video. But we've done this routine a million times, guys. Um, in my self-care videos, you guys know my routine. And... Uh, uh, yeah, just know anything I'm doing on my upper body, it's the same thing I'm doing on my lower body. Um, just that I won't show it in this video. Same to the showering, I just showed, I just showed you guys uh, me showering the upper part, but um, the lower part um, I didn't. And I'll, I'll include a video at the side. I got my legs scrubbed and massaged at Lux Nails Parlor, so I didn't see the need of scrubbing my legs again because they're still very very smooth so that's why I today didn't scrub my legs I just washed and yeah shaved that's all I did so I'm also going in with the oil but if I'm doing like my evening shower I usually use the oil alone I don't use the, the Cetaphil I just oil and it smells amazing the palmas um oil for dry and skin for dry itchy skin it really smells beautiful so that way my body i won't itch at all at all the entire day so for my tummy i'm going in with the palmas cocoa butter uh, massage cream for stretch marks so this is the one that i've also been using i also have the lotion version which i use at night because it's a bit lighter this one is heavy i usually use it um during the day at night and if i'm just like walking around the house i usually use the lotion um just to touch up in case i feel any itchiness i use the lotion um instead of the cream and it's also almost over um, I think it has like a few pumps on it also into birth. So I also, um, someone advised me to be, to start applying nipple cream. So I got the, okay, I'm not going to pronounce this name, but this is the lip, nipple cream that I'm using right now. Um, so someone told me it will help um, with the cracking. It will soften your nipples. Um, and it will give you an easier time during breastfeeding if you start to breastfeed they won't crack uh, as badly as if you didn't use it before so this is the nipple cream that I'm using and I also got it from Portal Pharmacy I'll also link it down below in case you're interested uh, for Dio I'm using the Belair deodorant soft flower it's 100% aluminium free 
I've been looking for aluminium free um, deodorants for a while so this is the one that I've been using of late the thing about aluminium free deodorants they don't last that long unfortunately so let me put in on lip balm and I want to put on a lip mask so the lip balm I always use is the blackberry shine I always get mine from Jumia sometimes they come highly highly discounted there and um, I just prefer using it there so let me just apply these two off camera or let me apply my lip mask <coughs> So I'm using the Laneige, Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask in the Mint and Choco um, scent or flavor or whatever you want to call it. I have to cover my face for this camera to focus. Sorry. So this is the lip mask that I'm using. And I got it from... I will link it down below when I remember. <laughs> I will link it down below the, the name of the shop. So I don't know where the applicator went. And I don't have the energy to look for it. I know it's either here or up there. So I'm just using a Q-tip um, to apply it. Because I don't know where the applicator went. I normally don't apply it um, as a sleeping mask. Because I don't want all of it to transfer on my pillowcase. So I usually apply it during the day. Uh, so that it can do its job at night. I'm thinking it will just transfer on my pillowcase So I'll just let it sit there uh, And I'll remove it Like way later on in the day Just let it do its job There So let me just apply this um, off camera and then put on my PJs and yeah I also got this really cute Christmas PJs from um, It's Oidera. If you don't know her, she she does Instagram content, amazing Instagram content. So she gifted me this set. Um, this is men's size uh, for obvious reasons. Um, and they are really, really cute. She has such an amazing collection um, of the Christmas PJs. She has other designs apart from this one. So this is not the only print she has, but I really, really love this set and it's so comfortable. This set is so comfortable and um, it fits my tummy so well. So I will link her page in the description box also. So you can DM her in case um, you're interested in uh, Christmas PJs. I just thought I'd put them on today and just share with you guys. Don't mind about my drawers in my room. I'm trying to, um, I'll be packing my hospital bag uh, tomorrow. So that's why there's a ton of things around. So yeah, I will link her in the description box in case you're interested. And um, you can grab yourself some Christmas PJs. Yeah. So I got this um, lactation cookie pack from Liquid Gold uh, for my baby shower gift. So it comes with lactation tea bags, um, cinnamon flavor, um, this are coconut lactation cookies. Okay, let me open this up. So the first cookies are the coconut um, lactation cookies. There is vanilla flavored cookies also. And the last one is choco chip cookies. This is so nice. I'm going to try them um, now. I think I'm just going to pick one of each and just try it with my four o'clock tea. Um, and they also have granola, breastfeeding granola. So this one has cranberry, almonds, pumpkin seed, chia, oats, flakes, dill, fennel, whatever this is, fenugreek, honey, cinnamon, brewers, yeast, salt, and raisin. So these are breastfeeding granola. All this is just to increase uh, milk production and you can start taking them before you even give birth. So I've put one of each of the cookies just to try them out. Plus I'm having um, the cinnamon tea bag with water. And then I will let you know how. Let me just taste one now. 
Mm. It's actually nice. It doesn't have a lot of sugar. Mm. These are good. <laughs>